Hello, this is Dennis with A1 Telephone Service and Repair, A1 Electronics. You can reach us on the web at www.a1-telephone.com and you can also reach us at 618-235-6959. Today I want to show you a really cool rotary desk telephone and this is Lee's telephone from Missouri. And she's got a note here and she talks about how the telephone was dropped off a desk and the dial was smashed and then she goes on and says uh, you know you can't dial out or receive calls basically and this is the initial checkout so we're going to go through the telephone but these telephones were made in Japan and they were made for the world market and depending on the market they had different types of various telephones that they made uh, that were the same size and this one is the real super fancy one and then they're better known and I'm going to show you another telephone here as the Petite and so basically they're the same telephone now Radio Shack put this telephone out they would put their name on it and that's what the companies would do they would put their name on it it was built for them and then this is kind of like the plain one but it's still fancy and then uh, I'll give you a look at that that's known as the Petite telephone so we want to move that out of the way and then this one was the real fancy telephone it had all the bling on it and we're going to go ahead and show it to you it's all metal the handset's metal the body is metal and then this is the inside of the telephone and then we have our schematic here that's in the base of the telephone and then our network and our dial so we basically want to go through this telephone and repair it for Lee but on the back side it says uh, made in Japan and it's a Takara and that's the model it says the highest decorative telephone set and so basically they're talking about how fancy the telephone is and so we even have like a spring that's on uh, the length of the handset cord so we're going to go ahead and get a look at this telephone troubleshoot it and repair it we'll get some more video as we move forward in the repair and we'll be right back okay we're back now and we're finishing up putting the dial back together again and we want to do a test on the dial so I want to finish putting the screws back into the dial here we want to tighten them up and then we'll test the dial and we've realigned everything in the dial and oiled, cleaned, and adjusted the points so now we want to try the dial out as you can see it's a lot more smooth it's the way it's supposed to be on the return now we want to plug the analyzer in and we want to watch our analyzer we're going to walk through our numbers you watch the numbers rack off I'm going to end in a 2 and one other issue we want to take a look at is the handset and in these older style telephones they have a transmitter in the handset that's known as a T1 and it has carbon granule crystals in it and over time what happens with them is the carbon granules do not align properly and they start causing all kinds of static uh, popping and cracking noises and this telephone we've uh, troubleshooted the handset 
and we know that the transmitter is causing a lot of noise in the line on the receive side. So we're going to try to get the telephone to reproduce that crackling noise and that sound. And what we want to do is I have my switch box pushed in and that will be on a normal line on a line out and we want to plug the telephone in. We're going to give you some dial tone. You might be able to hear that crackling and the popping. We want to take dial tone away and I want you to hear that. There's all kinds of cracking and popping and sizzling coming from this handset and that's basically from the T1. Now what we want to do is remove the T1 and show you that transmitter and that's the little sleeve that uh, it rides in. So we want to set that to the side. We want to go ahead and plug the unit in, give you some dial tone, and as you can see it's nice and quiet. We'll also go ahead and dial a 2, cause dial tone to go away, and it's nice and quiet. We'll do that one more time. Unplug the unit, plug it back in, give you some dial tone. We'll go ahead and unplug the unit, and as you can see, our T1 is bad in the transmitter of this handset and it's causing problems. So we're going to take a short break. We're going to try to replace that and we'll come back and get some more video. We'll be right back. Okay, we're back now and we are finished up with the repair of this telephone. We're going to run through a little bit about what went on. We went ahead and went into the rotary and repaired the rotary. We went into the network and resoldered some issues at the network. We went into the transmit and the receive and checked everything and the transmitter was bad so that was replaced. There's no need for that part any longer. It's of no use to us. It's noisy, it's creating a static sensation and it just needed to be replaced. So now what we want to do is our final checks. Since this telephone is so small they do not have a bell in it. They have a solenoid that gives a mechanical kind of a knocking or buzzer sound. So we want to go ahead and ring the telephone. I'll let that go a few times. time. Give you some dial tone. And as you can hear, the dial tone is more clear. It's not got the static sensation that you heard earlier. We want to walk through our numbers. If you watch the analyzer, we're going to walk through our numbers. I'm going to end in a 2. Now I want to transmit into the handset. So if you watch that red light on the analyzer, every time you see that red light light up, that's an indication of 100% modulation on transmit. <whistles> 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, hello, hello. So we know that this telephone is ringing in on a ring cycle. It has transmit and receive and it's dialing out. Now what we want to do is push this button on the switch box and that gives us a line out and totally takes the analyzer out of the situation and we'll call a time and temp number. And we'll go ahead and give you some dial tone. online.
online anytime at offenberg.com. Today is Tuesday, January 28th. The time is 11.53. Current temperature, 17 degrees. Very cold today, mostly sunny skies, highs around 17, mostly clear this evening, lows around 9. Sunny on Wednesday, highs in the lower 30s. Okay. We can also call my number, and it'll be busy. Give you some dial tone. Now that we know that this telephone has been repaired, we can return it to Lee and she can start enjoying this telephone again. These were better known as petite telephones or the cutie. And basically, they made them for the world market. There was a couple of different designs, but we showed you the most common one earlier in the video. And this is probably the most ornate one. So it's a pretty cool telephone and it's all metal. So that's a really a big plus. This is Dennis with A1 Telephone Service and Repair, A1 Electronics. You can reach us on the web at www.a1-telephone.com, and you can also reach us at 618-235-6959. Thank you for watching, and have a great day.